having understood what a contract is, which is an agreement between the employee and the employer, which governs that relationship between the work that is going to be done or the person who is going to do the work and the person who is giving the work. However, something that you definitely need to understand when you look at that contract, it should have the following things and oh, you should note that that contract you are going to sign definitely describes and has the following all written and elaborated or given to you in that contract one look at the employer's name and the place of work where you are going to work and what is your employer's name it's very important it should be speculated in the contract look at the workers names your name should quietly be spelled well in that contract the qualification should also be there the nationality is also must be part of what is included in one way or the other look at the date of conclusion of that contract is also very important as you're signing the contract make sure that the date of conclusion is also look uh, being written out clearly the nature of the type of work you're going to do that is always very important and has always put very many people in trouble because they definitely just put a hand in in a disguise of hurry or we know in some kind of forces that may be pushed in in, in other words no not even following what is supposed to to what is included in the contract look at the date of commencement of work when are you starting work and when that work will be or when are you going to end that uh, tenure or when you're going to end that contract then you look at the duration of the contract for how long it's going to be like that two years or three years definitely that should also be taken into account the agreed salary and benefit and benefits like accommodation transportation in case they definitely agree to you then you definitely need they need to be speculated or clearly and you should have that in mind and know this is what i'm going to work for then look at what you call the probation period for how long is going to be the probation period for my contract nine months six months or three months depending on what kind of nature